we are in Pay Center Mall. Somebody is going to get their uh, annual reporting done today. Yeah, that'd be me. I'm the immigrant here. Yeah, so where are we? Where is that again? No, we gotta go back that way. Okay. Jay Center Mall is the local BI office here in Cebu. And it's in Mendawe, so they're open. Yeah. But we're also gonna wander and do a little bit of grocery shopping afterwards, so come join our adventure for today. Now, I've been told that uh, the BI and CDO, you need an appointment for. I was here a few weeks ago and they didn't show anything about it. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get in. But upstairs there's a social security office, driver's license and everything else. So there's a ton of people here for that stuff. I was wondering why parking was so full. Oh, they got a Samsung store right here. I didn't know that. These guys normally have about the best exchange rate of any of the major ones. <laughs> In US dollars at 50.90. We think this is a line we're supposed to be in but I'm not sure. So we're gonna start here and the line's actually kind of moving fairly quickly, so. Oh, right there's Steps and Pain. There's an ACR card section, so I'm hoping it's right. Cause this is actually where I finished up last. ACR I card section, step one, check in there. Okay, I'm good. Yeah, after seeing the gentleman, he stapled all of our paperwork together. And then got told to head down this way. Window two. Window two. It used to be right here, right across the hallway. I'm not sure what happened. Maybe they're just renting. Uh, I know they might be renovating. They might be renting. I don't know. But we have another one around here. And I see window numbers. Is that Oh. Yeah, I needed to get out of sight of that card. <laughs> Didn't want to get yelled at for turning this back on. <laughs> we got receipt, we got all this fun stuff, and we're told to head back to this one. The ACRI card section. Hey, shorter line this time. <laughs> that piece of paper is all we needed to do. Got it dropped off back there. He took it, made some notes on the copies he took, and gave me everything back and said you're good see you next year uh, back over there where we yelled, where we got yelled at by the guard <laughs> I'm walking back over there to show you the windows they used to do it here last year that last year you went into that window dropped everything off a few minutes later got called into that window paid your fee and then came out here and got the receipt this year uh, you went into one window, dropped everything off, that they sh shuffled it over to the next window. You went up, paid a whole whopping 310 pesos, uh, and they handed you back the receipt and all the paperwork and said, go back there. And so you went back there, dropped everything off, and that's it. There's not a whole lot to pay in one of these. So now we're gonna go find some food. We're gonna do lunch. I'm gonna go find a CR and they go grocery shopping. We get milk and medicine for mama and papa. So not a whole lot. Bye bye, Roddy. Okay, last year when I did my annual check-in and did a little short video about it, that someone wrote it, somebody wrote a comment that I didn't give any info about how to do it. How-to videos are not a big thing of mine. But this year I decided to stick a little at the end explaining the process that you do need to do and the paperwork you need to go through. So here is the first part of that. The first thing you're going to need is if you've got a way to print them out beforehand, it's cool. If not, right behind this 
sign in the uh, hallway there is a printer that that's where I a uh, printer company that that's where I had everything printed out last year uh, it's like a couple five pesos per page to print so not a huge amount but you're gonna need a copy of your original ACR card front and back black and white copies work perfectly fine and then you're gonna need to bring your a copy of the info page the, the bio page of your US passport a copy of the 13a visa or whatever visa you're in the Philippines on a copy of the latest arrival stamp if it's a different stamp and a receipt from last year's previous payment unless it's your first payment obviously uh, but those are all the copies that you're gonna need to bring you bring them into that first window office unfortunately this is about the best picture I've got of the window that you start at that it's pretty clearly marked and, and if you ask any of the guards or anybody there that you're re you're doing your annual reporting they'll direct you to the correct window to start at after you see that guy that he checks everything over to make sure you've got all the right paperwork and then staples everything together and just hands it back to you and tells you to take it to the next window that the assessment window is just down the hall you hand it into the assessment window uh, window two that he they take it and hand it off to the cashier the cashier does all of his stuff and then we'll call you up to his window you pay 310 pesos and they tell you to bring it back so now you take the paperwork that they gave you uh, including your new pa your passport with a new receipt back to the original window that you started out at and hand everything back in at that window he'll keep all of the copies that you've made and give you back the receipt and your passport something I found out this year and I got lucky last year I happened to have it you need to keep that receipt for next year that they ask for a copy of it from now on uh, it's one of the copies that you're gonna need to make and bring with you or bring the old receipt and have a copy made but that's all there is to checking in at J Center Mall. It's going to vary a little bit by which offices you go to, but the procedure should still be basically the same. And as Cindy said earlier in the process, uh, video, that the entire process took maybe 30 minutes to do. Not difficult, not terribly time consuming. But that's it.